Well, about 12 years ago, starting at Harvard, a new branch of psychology has come into being, and it's called positive psychology. Because a group of psychologists said, why do we only, why do we only study dysfunction? Obviously, a lot of people are functioning most of the time. Wouldn't it be valuable to society if we figured out how they get it done right? How they remain positive, how they raise children rather than how they don't raise them well? So positive psychology was born, and a whole bunch of research has been done. It's a massive branch of psychology now. And one of the things they, they discovered was there was a direct connection between happiness and productivity. Productivity being not just defined in a business sense, but productivity literally meaning to lead or move forward. That's what the word means in Latin. So we are productive in the context of the gospel when we are closing the gaps between who we are and who we can potentially be. When we are living more in concert with the Spirit than we have been in the past. So we are moving forward. We are being productive. Here's the connection between productivity and happiness. Now imagine this. Really smart people at Harvard had to figure this out. You've known this since you were 12. The happier people are, the more productive they are. That's the big aha from the Ivy League. But we all know from experience, right? If you wake up and you're miserable, that's not your best day. The happier you are, the more productive you are. So guess what one of the arguments we make to businesses is every day? Are you as productive as you want to be? The answer is always no. So we tell them it's really quite simple. If your people were happier, they'd be more productive. And a lot of business leaders say, well, we're not in the business of making people happy. I said, then you're not in the business of productivity. Because when your people are miserable, it's reflected in their productivity. So then they ultimately ask, well, how do you make people happy? Because the, the, one of the things is this. Different things make different people happy.